Well, hey guys, I'm Tim Langston with Red Dog Bushcraft, and today I thought we'd take just a quick look at a new knife I just got from the Pathfinder Knife Shop. This is the Buffalo Skinner. Let me move the camera in a little bit closer, and we'll take a look at her. Okay, there you are with a closer look. This, once again, is the Buffalo Skinner by PKS. Uh, at the time that I purchased this knife, it was $79.95, and I'll go over the specs. It's one eighth of an inch thick of 1095 high carbon steel with a 90 degree spine. The overall is approximately nine and three quarter inches. The blade length is five and one half inches and is blued. The handle material is walnut. The grind is Scandinavian. The weight of the knife is 6.2 ounces. And once again, the knife manufacturer is PKS, which is the Pathfinder Knife Shop, which is located in Indianapolis, Indiana. The blade comes with a lifetime warranty and made right here in the United States. I think this is a really cool knife shop that is putting out some very high quality work. I decided to go with the leather CK sheath, which was an additional $29.95. But they also have some Kydex and some hybrid options that you can choose from. And those all vary in price depending on the options that you want. The leather sheath that I chose is traditional. It fits the knife very well. It's made out of a good high quality leather. And uh, the fit and finish is perfect. So that's enough about the specs. Now let's talk about what the knife will do well if you're looking to do some kitchen work or if you're out on the trail and it's time to process your supper up yes she will process your dinner cut your bacon and with that butcher knife design i am sure she is going to be awesome when it comes to uh, processing up game this thing reminds me a lot of a good traditional uh, butcher knife as far as the shape but what i really like is the way this point here at the end that's going to give you all of the things that you need for boring gives you that nice hump on the back that you need when you start processing game and doing your skinning but it's got that overall shape that's good for slicing and uh, doing things in the kitchen like cutting your bacon. Alright, so like I said, this blade is blued, not coated. So we should be able to use that in the event that we lost our steel for our flint and steel. Let's get us a piece of char cloth laying on, laid on here. If I can get hold of it, right? Hands don't want to work too good today. Let's see what we can do. Oh yeah. All right, we're on fire. So. We can start fire that way. Let's take a look at how she does with the ferro rod. Get it up here a little bit. I think that'll work. That'll work just fine. And you know, I love processing my fat wood. So let's see how that 90 degree spine scrapes after we put it through a little bit of abuse. I don't think we've affected it one bit. Has some nice curls coming off of there without a whole lot of effort. And let's see if we can get some real fine stuff coming. Oh yeah. Just enough where we can transfer from those little small 
pieces of dust into some small curls. That's uh, pretty nice stuff there. And while we got it, let's hit it one time. That'll work for me every day. And y'all know I'm not big on batoning a knife. I believe in carrying an axe and a saw, but sometimes you may have to get to the inside because of the shape. Now, I don't have a very big tongue in here, but I just wanted to uh, do a couple pieces just to show it would do it. I know there's going to be no damage to the blade because this is the third knife that I've had from Pathfinder Knife Shop. And I don't know what they're doing to their heat tree, but they are spot on. The blades hold up extremely well, but yet they're not so hard that they're brittle. They are, uh, <laughs> to me, they're very reminiscent of the old, um, old timer knives when I grew up. They hold an edge good and they're easy to sharpen. And uh, there's just something about the angle that they have on their Scandinavian that uh, that I really like. Alright guys, thanks for joining me today as we took a quick look at the Pathfinders Knife Shops Buffalo Skinner. I was waiting a long time to get this thing and I'm telling you what, I am not disappointed. I've really enjoyed using it in the kitchen. It's been great out in the field. And I'm looking forward to processing some game with it here real soon. Thanks for joining me once again. I'm Tim Lanks with Red Dog Bushcraft, home of global safety and survival. Until next time, God bless.